From the Cruise Radio studio in Jacksonville, Florida, this is Cruise Radio News with Doug Parker. Here's your cruise news for Monday, March 22nd, 2021. Royal Caribbean has announced it'll be launching round-trip cruises from Nassau, Bahamas beginning this June. Adventure of the Seas will sail a series of seven-night voyages from the port, including some that include two consecutive days at Royal Caribbean's private island, Perfect Day. All crew adult passengers must be vaccinated, while those under 18 will need to present a negative PCR test before boarding. And along the same vein, Celebrity Millennium is set to launch round-trip Caribbean voyages from St. Martin on June 5th. The vessel will operate two itineraries, one stopping in Aruba, Barbados, and Curacao, while the second is visiting St. Lucia, Barbados, and Tortola. Like Royal Caribbean, all crew and adult passengers will need to be vaccinated, and kids under 18 must present a negative PCR test taken within 72 hours of embarkation. And finally, Azamara has officially renamed the former Pacific Princess, which it acquired from Princess Cruises back in January. The vessel was officially handed over to her new line on March 15th and has been renamed Azamara Onward. Soon, the ship will undergo an extensive renovation to reflect the Azamara brand. Onward is scheduled to sail her inaugural season in Europe next year. And cruise line stocks closed up on Friday. Carnival Corporation 28.96, up 2.4%. Royal Caribbean 90.72 up 2.6% and Norwegian up the same at 27 or rather 29.70. Breaking news and up to the minute industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. In my camper because it's too windy outside, I'm Doug Parker with Cruise Radio News. The proceeding was a production of Cruise Radio. For more accurate and dependable updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.